can never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you What's up guys? Um, I'm with my brother. Uh, today we're working on my brother's car uh, rebuilding. What episode is this? Episode 3. Episode is it, 3. Is it 3? <laughs> it or, should be 3. Or 4. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> what are the other? Anyways, welcome back to the channel guys. My brother finally went ahead and got all the suspension components. I'll show you guys what we got exactly. So this is the full suspension from left to right. So we have the lower control arm, upper control arm, tie rods, and sway bar end links. We went ahead and got both sides the full kit mainly because I don't want to go ahead and fix a couple of them and then it's like you guys can see like this wheel straight this one's off anyways let's go ahead and uh jack up the car right let's, uh, yeah let's get to it let's just let's just get it let's get, get, get the car in the air All right guys, so I don't know if you guys can see this control arm right here. I think it's called the lower control arm. It's supposed to be straight like that, but it looks like this. So let's go ahead and replace that guy first and see how much of a difference that makes. Are you seeing this? I didn't even know yes. a tool can do that. <laughs> Dude, what? I need one of these. You get sponsored by the way. <laughs> Dude, wow, come on, man. <laughs> Dude, this thing broke that nut off like it was nothing. Guys, when I had this on the M3, it took me maybe like an hour or two trying to break this thing loose with WD-40 or whatever. This gun took it out like it was nothing. <sighs> Thank bro, you, bro. It broke the bolt off like it was nothing. <laughs> what happened, you broke it? No, I took oh, it off like yeah. instantly. This thing's nice, man. I'm gonna take this shit. Let me see, let me see. And you can now have one. Loyalty part, man. Get yourself one. Let me be 100 percent realistic with you. I don't know why, but that looks so OEM. Yeah, it looks so. It looks normal, but because like you know, these are hella bends too. But yeah. Nah, that's why you gotta like look on the internet to see how they actually look. That that is bent. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and install this guy. Alright guys, before we actually tighten up this bolt right here some more, we actually do need to jack up this whole hub and then tighten it so we don't mess up these bearings back here. Alright guys, so we just tighten up these bolts right here. So the only thing we need to do now, honestly, on the other side is replace the sway bar end link and then we're good to go. So I think because of the impact on the other side, it actually like pulled this over and snapped the sway bar end link. So uh, we're just going to go ahead and replace this on this side and I think everything else should be good to go. Um, and then we'll just keep the extra suspension for spare parts. So the is just putting on the wheel right now. Um, we're gonna go ahead and tighten up that rear bolt once the car is sitting down all proper and stuff. The good thing is you have none of the front end assembled. So once we get the wheels on, I can literally put my hand back there and tighten it. So we don't, we don't need to have a second jack for this process, which is nice. So yeah, this side's got the new sway bar inlink. My brother tightened that. And then we put on the new lower control arm. So all these extra control arms are just gonna be keeping them as spares because we're always gonna need these guys, especially with E90s, E92 chassis. Yeah, never hurts up extra parts. Luckily, if you guys look at it from right here, that is straight. And from right here, this looks really good. officially out of the shop so you guys know I am heading on my trip so I got to get some uh, SD cards for John so you guys should film for you guys on his GoPro I want him to be able to capture the process even though I'm not going to be there so you guys let me know how much you want to see do you want to just see him like you know just show you the before and after when it's on when it's not on when he does the tank when his tanks off when he does the suspension when the tank switches off and you guys actually want to see him install the lines and all that good stuff down below so let me know if you guys want the extended version, we have to break it down into two videos. Because no one wants like a 60 minute video, that'd be crazy. It's like 220, 230 minute videos, that'd be perfect. But anyways, let's head down to Walmart and pick up those SD cards. Need a suitcase deal? Let's get going. Let's get going. 
guys sd cards got so cheap all of a sudden like 128 gigs for 20 bucks what 64 gigs for 12. I think I'm gonna go ahead and go two of these to be safe, and I know that he has more than enough. Uh, let's just go with two of those guys. Thank you. Let me know. I need to rate that. You attempted? Bro, they got they got sweet potato pie. What, they got like 50 cents? They got they got cherry pie. They got what is this? This is why America is they fat. Got, <laughs> <laughs> they got only 50 cents. I'm what? So no, I was gonna get this and dip. Fucked up. So we just got the SD card. Let's head over to John. Give him the SD card. He's doing me a huge favor. Shout out to him. Finally here, we're just gonna be giving him the SD card. Then we are heading back. So let's go ahead and uh, see if he's still here. What happened? You seem worried. Huh? You seem worried. No, what happened? Did you oh. Listen? Oh, fuck. I yeah. forgot about nah, that. Yeah, appreciate it. Is that good enough? Yeah. All right, cool. Is that the right size? Mm -hmm. All right, cool. I appreciate you, brother. Let me know if you need more, and then I'll just okay. send you Venmo. Yeah. All right, brother. Cool. Take care. All right. Take care. So what's up guys, we are home and uh, you guys saw I'm kind of all over the place. This video is kind of incomplete. You guys are probably wondering what's going on nor what's going on. And by the time you guys are watching this video, I'm gonna be back from my trip from Canada. I spent the entire week with the family. I needed my rest, I pretty much tried to relax. I'm actually like, right now I'll be talking to you guys, I haven't even went on my trip yet. This is me, I'm trying to record as much as possible, bring you guys as much content as possible that I believe is more of a vlog style. So you guys can let me know whether you like that or not. But hopefully after this video, we're gonna go straight into the bags and all the good stuff, the car giveaway, and actually want to do another car giveaway um, and stuff like that. Like there's a bunch of things that are gonna be coming up and I'm ready for it. I'm just waiting for after this family trip, trying to relax, trying to recoup, trying to get that strength back and everything after this trip. I really don't wanna bring YouTube on this trip. I wanna enjoy it with the family. It's the last family trip we're ever gonna have. So yeah, if you guys are wondering what's going on with all these vlog videos, it's because your boy was on a trip and he's finally gonna come back. Hopefully the next video, I'm back from my trip and it's gonna be straight into the bag. We're gonna go straight into the bag. We're gonna go straight into aero kits on the 435. We're gonna go straight into performance mods with Keys Motorsports. We're gonna go straight, you know, we're gonna go straight through it. And then we're also gonna be buying the car giveaway. Hopefully I actually pick out the car and then as soon as I get back, Canada, I'll actually buy the car and show you guys as soon as possible. I just don't want to act on anything because I don't want to leave any projects in the garage for like a week or two while I'm in Canada. That's just unfair for the rest of the people at the shop, you know? So I hope you guys understand where I'm coming from. I'm sorry that this is a short video, but I hope you guys understand this is a small break I'm going to be taking because 2020 is going to be insane and I'm budgeting for some pretty big things. So. If you guys trust me, if you guys have faith in me, believe that I'm gonna bring you out some great content. Without further ado, guys, I love you guys so much. Remember to stay humble. I low-key love every single one of you guys. Without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Did I say low-key? I meant high-key. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on the search with my words, and I put them all together in search, cause I wanna have worth.